ladies, gentlemen, let the show begin. All right, do you like video games? And I know you do. What about entertainment? We got that to video game. I'm not a video game. Video game. I know what's the name? Video game Armada. This is one drama the gamer boss bronze coming back to you with another let's preview. Today we got another switch goodie in the demo side for Valkyrie Chronicles 4. Now the Valkyria or Valkyrie whatever Chronicle series has usually been a Sony joint. However, the times they be changing and the switch train of goodness keeps plowing through. Ooh boy. So I've wanted to play this series for a while, but since I've been more on the anti-Sony things of late, I haven't had a chance to get my grubby little hands on my chance to play this series, but now I can. Oh, thank you, Nintendo. Thank you, Switch. Now, the thing about uh, Valkyrie Chronicles 4 is it's like in the middle between 1 I and 3. I guess so hopefully I don't really need to know what's going on but what I do know is anime cross with a sort of alternate reality World War II scenario so uh, here we go and it's also a strategy game and I haven't played one of those in a while so here we go all right see so here's here's the skinny people I actually started this recording like maybe five days ago and two and two days ago while I was about to go and edit this sucker and put it on like the internet for yesterday it broke stupid recording didn't record didn't get half my footage dang on it so uh, now I'm redoing this so I kind of know what to do in this first bit here so if it seems like I've played this before it is because I've had so uh, you guys will just have to bear with me to you know, go through this again. I will be much more efficient this time because I kind of know what I'm doing. But if you've never seen, you never played uh, Valkyrie Chronicles before, much less this demo, this will be brand new to you. So there you go. None of us yet knew. We couldn't foresee what this war would cost us. It was a battlefield, but it was where we grew up. East, clear skies, and uh, uh, uh. Huh? nap time's over. Come on, Raz. I wasn't napping, just resting my eyes. You gotta relax, man. You are way too freaking tense. Your hands are shaking. <laughs> so sack up, Commander. It's about time we get ready to roll out. Let's show those imps what's coming to them. Yeah. Shift in the wind. There. Huh? You getting those wind whispers again? Imperials incoming! All right, boys. Oh boy, he's a wind so man, sir. And those guys were in the flowers. At least if they were sleeping, they had a good place to sleep. This is Commander Claude Wallace. Squad E. The Imperial forces are on the move, heading for your position. Claude is a good name, but Barrett Wallace is a much better name. Until they're done shelling the area, we should have time to prepare. Kai, take a group to that southern hill and slow down their left flank. 
Raz, take two soldiers east and make some noise for me. You got that? Gotcha. Keep up or get left behind. At your command. Hoffin, roll out. Squaddy, ready to engage. All right. Just remember your training. And thus, how this episode begins. As you can see, we got a, you know, somewhat like a, a standard protag guy who's calm and well-meaning. And we have, I guess, the edgy best friend who wants the protag not to be such a wuss. Being a wuss is good at times, but in war, yeah, I'm going to have to side with the edgy guy. Don't be a wuss in battle. It just doesn't work out. Anywho, let's get to the actual fighting thing now, please. Yes, again. Eliminate all Imperial hostiles. Let's stop their advance. Squad E, move out. All set, Raz? Just say the word, boss. I'm locked, loaded, and in freaking mid. Okay. First, we'll see how they respond to some infantry. Squad E, move out. With this game, I can just press the button at the mouse, so all the voices should line up rather well. Just not right now. So basically, this is just like, sort of like a, uh, well, this part right here is more like a, uh, codename Steam. Now, I don't know if Valkyrie, uh, yeah, Valkyrie Chronicle series, you know, uses these, uh, command point systems for attacking and movement, but that's what they're doing in Valkyrie Chronicles 4. So like codename Steam on the 3DS, your characters do things dictated by how many command points you have. Like Raz, he's going to shoot this thing, uh, which is a red dot, but you'll see in a second, it is not just red dot, it's the enemy. Command! Oop, got nope. this. Select! Yeah, that's what I was going for. And now... Ah, get behind this! Show no weakness. Oh. Hold still now. It's been a minute since I did this, so, uh, that was... Let's see, which one is the fire? Whoop. Hmm. Fire? I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be firing right now. Let's, uh, move this just a touch. Fire? Ah, there it is. I hate that, you know, why is it the trigger button the actual trigger button, please? That would be nice. Uh, Nintendo, work on that. Make your trigger buttons the actual trigger for guns in strategy games. I suppose they're pretty good in most games. Anywho, surprise attack! <sighs> I said surprise attack. Fire? Be sure to check. Uh. Fire? <laughs> I swear, people, I did play this once. Attack? Nope. 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 Attack? Nope. Attack? Nope. Attack? Nope. Attack? 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 Nope. 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 Attack? Attack? Eh, come on, just... Not a grenade! Not a ragnade! Whatever that is. Yes! Fire! Attack! Do it! There. Okay, people, just so you know, press the bumper, the right bumper, 
to aim your weapon and then press the A button to attack. Just, just, just so you know. Crouch. All right, so that's that. Yes. A is also confirmed. Oh boy. Come on, game. You're making me look bad over here. Damn it, these assholes are in my way. I can't break through this. Why not? You're. Are you really getting tripped up over some common foot? Sorry about that. I keep. I'm, I, I, I'm. 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 I'm jumping the gun here. Basically, Kai's the sniper. She's good at sniping. She's not a frontline soldier, so don't put her in the way of being shot at. Just have her stay way behind the hill. I will demonstrate. See where she is right now? She's safe here. Now get a little closer. And zoom in. Make sure to zoom in. Pro tip. The little weird buttons on the Switch controller, that's l like the uh, old cross pad. Back in the day, and they're just like four cross, uh, four buttons in the shape of a cross. They help you accurately aim in this game. So that's important. So once it's lined up, just press the A button, like I, I attempted to do with the uh, other guy. Now, a little warning, however, even though I'm super dead center right here, some strange reason, I might misfire. Yeah, I know, right? He's not even moving. He's not even, un like, in cover or nothing. If he was in cover, I get that. But nope, because the game demands it, sometimes you'll miss your shot. Hopefully it won't be this time, because I'm, like, right dead center in his face. Let's let's do this. Let's see what happens. Okay, good. He, he did not miraculously survive a shot to the head. So, you're done. Now, uh, let's see. The other enemy is way over there. I, I can't... Can I even hit the map? Map? Hmm. I can't map. Let's see how the... Okay, there's the, there's the map, I suppose. So, there's two more there. So, I'm just going to wait this out. Because I need for them to get closer. Alright. What's your name? Gaz or something? What's your... No. Come on. Come on. I got one more point. Come... Yeah, there we go. Raz. I guess that's your name. Raz. Get moving, Raz. Hup, 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 hup. Alright. Now. The, um... Since the tutorial's off now because I already played the stage before. There's one other thing you gotta know is that anytime you, as long as you have command points, you could do stuff with the soldiers on the field. But if you keep using the same soldier with your command points, you'll become less effective over time and you can only move like half your speed. So uh, keep that in mind. I know using this sniper chick is great because she's got range and all, but sooner or later, she's gonna hardly be able to move or and or hit things if you keep her up. Keep her up, because she'll get tired or battle fatigue or whatever. Just a little heads up for people who are going to play this game, which I would recommend. So far, so good. I'm enjoying it. The enemy phase. Come on, enemy. Come get some. Now, if I recall correctly, since I got my guy behind a sandbag and he should be able to see this guy. Nope. He's, he's still too far away. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. Here's the other one. Aw, oh, poor enemy. They are just super wide open. They cannot, they cannot save themselves. Alright. Cutscene! About time, Claude. Yeah, I know. Soldiers, forward! Now's our chance to take the offensive. All right, now here I'll get uh, get some uh, reinforcements. That's good. Now none of these reinforcements are cool or anything, but they all have their specialties. Like uh, frontline soldier dude here, he's good with frontlining, and he's got a friend over here who's also good at frontlining. These guys over here, they're scouts, which means they got like super duper movement. So if you want to get somewhere fast. 
these guys are the people to pick. And of course, as you know, Kai is the sniper. She just only needs a little bit of movement to make an impact with her sniping. First things first, Raz, you get to the sandbags because go over. Zip. Go, 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 go. Rawr. Now make sure to stay in the sandbag. But first, target mode. Let's, I'll see. Uh, kind of out of range, so you, I don't think this is gonna work. So let's, uh, oh, no, no. Yes, let's get out of attack mode. Uh, get out of attack mode, get out of attack mode. Out, forget it, go, stop, 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 stop. Cancel, there we go. And, uh, oh, crouch. And let's end that action. I just wanted just to make sure that dude was there because, like I said before, if I recall correctly, if I have someone hiding behind cover and the enemies come close enough to be in firing range, guess what's going to happen? They're going to automatically attack, which is very handy. All right, who's next? Zyga? Come on, Zyga. Join other guy. And crouch. And you're done. Now. It's your turn, Sniper. 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 Sniper, come on, sniping. Start, 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 snipe. There we go. All right. Now. She should have the ability to snipe them since they're a little closer now. Zip, 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 zip. There we go. Beautiful. You know, sniping is a good class when you want to pick off weaklings from a distance at for at very very little risk to yourself sure you may miss and you know it takes forever to load up a gun but uh if you could make your shots i say go sniper i like a more automated frontline infantry style of fighting myself but hey that's just me now cross your fingers people let's see if this actually hits Tink. yes Yes, it does. Too easy. Good oh, job, boy. Kai. You're going to get that promotion. Now, I could... I believe I could shoot this guy as well, since I got one more command point. I'm going to save my command point, because, as you would know, command points that you don't use get uh, added to the next set of command points in the next round. For you, not for the enemy. That would be sad if it was for the enemy. And my face. I'm even about to move the other guys. I just need the two frontliners and my snipes. Come and get it. Shoot him. There you go. See what I say? A little placement at the frontline infantry goes a long way. And they just got filled full of lead. Ha ha ha. But what's this? Uh oh. It's boss tag time. That's not good. As in any good strategy game featuring warlord type antics, tanks are involved. Now tanks are tough. You, infantry can't really fight a tank. Now I know they said, oh sure, tanks got out. Tanks got like weak spots. You could shoot them in the butt and they'll hurt. I tested that my first th through uh, uh, tutorial through in this stage and that's a bald faced lie. Oh sure, the bullets seem to work, but, and this is a really big but, the damage is so minuscule, it's almost laughable. So, just leave tank fighting to other okay, tanks. That's just, just a smart way to go. Alright, let's see if I can pilot this thing. I can't get past the gate. Oh well. I don't need to get past the gate. I can shoot it from here. And fire. Oh, poor light tank. You don't got much. All 
Alright, and current situation. Okay, Fight again. There we go. So, uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but uh, my movement got reduced a, a little bit since I'm attacking again with the tank. So, uh, oh, and I don't have any, I don't have a lot of ammo left here, so. Oh yeah, certain guns have like infinity ammo, which is fine, but tanks, not so much. So make sure your shots count. Alright, I got one more shell left. And I got plenty of command points, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna end my current action and attack again. It's a good thing I don't need to have to move, because I can't really move very far now. But I can shoot. So target, shoot tank. And the day is saved. Thanks to Heavy Artillery. Operation complete. Yeah. And that was pretty much my first recording. And since I know what I'm doing, <laughs> more or less, this went quicker than the first time I did this. So, there you go. This guy's so mopey about the flowers. It it's a theme. Oh, yeah. They didn't stand a chance. Come on, man. You're supposed to be commander of the Ranger Corps. A commander still has a heart. Same as a foot soldier. Rank. Oh, Whoops. Sorry about that. Flowers. Even little girls have bigger balls these days. Maybe. I have the lips to the, the match, so I really should not jump the gun here. Alright, I get it. Power of the heart, blah, blah, blah. Look, just go turn in your report already, will ya? Can't go get sloshed if we're stuck here on standby. Good point. I'll head to the command center. Yeah, you do that. And tell the brass to send us tougher gimps to fight next time, yeah? All right, how'd we do? Hey, I got... That looks like a four, but I'm going to assume that's an A rank. Because the last time I did this, I only got a B rank because I was goofing around a bit. So, yeah, all right. That's how you do it. Like, I, you have just have, like, the standard C, B, A, or S, or X, or Z ranks, whatever. All right, now... That's where I last left off, so uh, that's where I'm going to leave off for this video. <laughs> I know, right? It's just like I wasted my own time. But I didn't waste your time because you guys never seen this before. Uh, unless you played the demo already, in which case you didn't watch it before. And I hope I did better than you guys thought I was going to do. I don't know. But anyway, I'm just going to end it here, and then we'll pick up on the next day. And I'm going to see how long I can write this demo out. So until the next time, this is the one drawing the Gamer Boss Bronze telling you to stay tuned for the latest video game armada transmission. Till then though, take care.